Hey Libra, this is Nikki. Thanks for joining me for a weekly reading. I hope it resonates with you all. As always, take what you need and leave the rest to my new subscribers and my regulars. Thank you so much for being a part of my journey. All right. If you all are interested in the current sale I have going on now or any of the other readings, the information is posted below. Okay. I've already done a lot of pre-shuffling, so we're going to get right on into your reading. Spirit guides and angels, please give me some messages here for the Libra for their timeless reading. What message do you have for me to pass on? Uh, the Queen of Cups. Okay. We have the Seven of Wands. What else is going on here? The Hermit card. Clarify the Queen of Cups for Libra. We have the Ten of Pentacles and we have the Ten of Swords. So there's some kind of hurtful uh, situation that you carry, that you, you still care for somebody. Maybe you broke up with somebody, the relationship ended, and you're still carrying around your feelings for this person. You still love this person, okay? But you have to find your way out of it. And now you're reminiscing, you're thinking about this person, but this person was kind of like evil to you, treated you wrong, they didn't treat you fairly here, okay? And I think that you're finally, you're reflecting on the fact that you've gotten out of this relationship. You've cast this person, this evil person, or this evil deity out of your life. They are no longer with you, okay? But you still have feelings for this person because you loved them. You know, because you're not with this person anymore doesn't mean you still don't have feelings for them, even though you know that they weren't good for you. They were an evil person. Something too about them being an evil doer, okay? Messages here for Libra. We have three of swords. They definitely broke your heart in judgment. Uh, maybe you all got a divorce. Or maybe this person was very harsh to you, very rude to you, said, said hurtful things to you. And it was just a necessity for you to get yourself out of this person's energy. Bottom of the deck, I have the Prince of Cups. Okay. Um, this person may have been a little bit younger than you. If, you know, this is the kind of person, even though they may have been a, a little younger than you or maybe young acting, they really didn't know how to handle their feelings the way you did in a mature level way. This person um, kind of like, uh, weren't, they weren't logical with, with what they were saying to you because they were very illogical. They just didn't know. They still weren't matured. They still hadn't matured in their mind the way you have. Okay. So they didn't know how to really, how, how to filter their anger or filter their words. Just let, They just let it all come out. They just, they just, their feelings were just, they cared about you so much that they, it was just, they were just in overdrive. No matter what they did or how they did this, they just, the person didn't even know the, the meaning of the word filter. So we got the devil card, but I have the chariot. Okay. You moving your energy away from this person. This person couldn't even now can't figure out why did you leave me? You know, cause you were no good for me. You know, you broke my heart. And we have the moon card. Probably he had to, he found, you probably found out he or she had some secrets. Because they, they left you out in the cold or you left them out in the cold. Whatever you found out about this person, it hurt you. And you said, well, I'm done. I wiped my hands of this. I can't do this anymore. I am done. We got you being in a hermit mode. And this person here is, is, is still trying to figure out. Not only are you in hermit mode, they are too trying to figure out why you left them. Wanting to know if, if you will ever take them back. And you're like, no, I'm done. I'm never ever going to take you back. Because I got the nine of cups. I need to find my wish fulfillment elsewhere. This person has some toxic energy, negative energy around them. Very, very regretful that they didn't work out. You pull yourself away from them. Your energy is now split. If we have the chariot. You're moving on forward to your wish fulfillment. But your person is moving on to drugs and alcohol. If they weren't already on them. Okay? But you still have them in your heart. But that that's life. We got the sun card. you getting happy somewhere else. You're finding your peace of mind without this person in your life. Okay, they hurt you. You have to make that judgment call and the universe is saying, oh, that's it. We, we're done. We're not going to keep doing this, you know. And this person like, wow, you know, can I ever come back to you or whatever? Three of Cups, you know, um, celebrate your happiness. Celebrate your peace of mind without this person in your life, okay. What is the secret about this person? Secret, we got the temperance card. And we got the Ten of Cups. So the secret to this person, it may have been, uh, even though this person, maybe you all had a good relationship when it came to money, their heart was somewhere else. They had love somewhere else. They probably even had another kid or two somewhere else. Plus, this person probably had a secret life with somebody, with another woman or another man, you know, and you just didn't know. You found out about it, though. That's why it hurt so much. Hell, they probably left you to be with that person anyway. 
okay? And you don't understand why they left. Well, they left you to be with somebody else, but you can't understand why this could happen to a person like you. Because this person didn't know what they want. You weren't the person for this per you weren't the right person, Libra, for this person anyway. Okay? The strength card. We have the four of cups. So that they, they may at some point try to come back to you, but the universe is saying, let them go. You know, I have another blessing for you. And you may be up at night thinking about this person and wondering how this person can treat you the way they treated you, being kept up at night, you know. And, you know, you may be online looking at their pictures, looking at their email, looking at old messages that this person sent you or vice versa or whatever. Because you're still holding on to your feelings with this Queen of Cups. And I got the Four of Pentacles. You're still holding on to the hopes that they may come back, even though... Uh, maybe you broke up with them. However, maybe this is for two people. One you one set of you broke up with that with this person. The other set they broke up broke up with you and went to somebody else. If you broke up with them, you don't want them back. But if they broke up with you, you're holding it holding in your head and your heart that they will come back to you. But they hurt you. And and the people who release themselves from this person's energy, they hurt you. They may have been a good financial stability for you but you don't need that anymore because they were no good for you they had this devil energy this toxic energy some of you i'm telling you um you're thinking about this person so much that you may think i want this person back you know um i care about this person you just can't seem to let this person go and you like i said looking at pictures looking at emails or text messages trying to figure out damn this eight of cups are they coming back um, are they coming back can we work this out can we figure this out you know, wanting if this person's going to come back to you, you know. The person left you, or you left them to be with somebody else, another family who you loved and cared about, who they loved and cared about, okay. They left you to be with their wish fulfillment, to be with their happy home. They left you. So why would you want them back, Libra? And that's some of you, okay. If you didn't leave them, they left you. Take it whatever side you roll with, all right. So I'm going to finish this up with some channel messages that I wrote down. Take what you need here. Um, and these messages, Libra, if they don't relate to you, they probably relate to somebody in your energy field. Okay? You probably will know who this is. Okay? I'm going to pull three. Excuse me. I'm going to pull three of these cards. Give me three cards, universe, for Libra. Three cards for Libra. What are their messages for this week? Two more for Libra. One more. All right. All right. So these are your messages. I hope they relate to you or somebody around you. Be careful. They may swing both ways. Have you had a test to just be sure that everything is okay down there? Male or female, take it how it resonates. All right. Just peachy, isn't it? How wrong they did you. Now they are about to get it back. Ten times as bad as they did you. Okay. And finally... It shouldn't have to be this way. For some reason, I just don't like you. I tried to find something about you that I like, but I just couldn't. Okay? This person, whoever it was, they just don't like you no matter, or vice versa. You know, this came out in the Virgo reading and in the Sagittarius reading. So a lot of people are having issues with people who just don't like us. That's just how it is, you know. Well, I hope this message resonates with you all. Bye, Libra. I'll see you again next week.